Hi, this is Craig. Hey, I'm in my car because I just, uh, life goes on. I just took my wife with our granddaughter. Those two went to a tea party. Granddaughter's 10 years old. So things just continue. Just because you have cancer doesn't mean life doesn't go on. I'm fortunate. I'm 77. I'm retired. And so I don't have obligations like before. My biggest obligation now is to make sure that I get to infusion when I'm supposed to and all the other doctors that go with it. Uh, I'm not sure how I got everything done before I was retired, to tell you the truth. But uh, this is my cancer journey. This is the this is the fourth poem I've written. I wrote no poems pre-cancer, and yet I've written, oh, as of today, I think it's 57. Uh, I'm going to post them over time, uh, one at a time. Uh, so today, I'm just sitting at a park. Uh, maybe you can see. I'm just chilling, uh, and I thought, well, I'll, I'll get this taken care of. Uh, this poem is a little a bit spiritual. Uh, if you're not spiritual, you might want to just go to something else for the moment. <clears throat> but it's called, Are You Sure? Are You Sure? A good friend died last week. He had fought right to the end. Then put the spotlight on cancer, shows the race will not bend. To lung cancer he succumbed, and loss does not make much sense. Sorry that he is now gone, for his, his impact on me was immense. Gives me pause, since humans we do set our own course. It's not always flawless, since the doctor's intellect is the source. Foggy reports we rely on. It helps us create our, our great plans. Unfortunately, much of the time we depend on vague PET scans. I've heard it said before there are no atheists in foxholes. That is much like us in our respective cancer roles. When at age 27, a spiritual experience I had, it showed me that there is a higher power, and for this I am glad. You could say we make this up just to help us endure, but when things happen that can't, it gives us hope for a cure. Relying on God, or whatever you call it, gives strength to continue and even, if even, just for a bit. And if there is no God, no damage is done. But if there is a mighty one, then a prize you have won. So I'll have another one in uh, a few days. And if you're the, the person with cancer, just know life continues. It's okay. Just uh, hang on and... Most of the time, things are going to go well for you. And all of you that are supporting this person with cancer, uh, use this as a jump-off point to talk to them about what things are going on and what's to be expected and what happens after this life. Thanks. Have a great day.